Hi guys, thanks very much for coming back for this, I really appreciate it, hopefully it's a nice quick one for you, it fixed it for me, if there's anyone out there struggling, I just hope that it helps them. Apologies if this isn't the answer you were looking for, I'm still learning myself, I'm still going through all these settings, as you can see, there is millions of them, millions of me, so bear with me. For me, there was a huge difference when OBS was trying to capture the gameplay I was doing, recently it was in Sekiro, where... The OBS on the left monitor was capturing the gameplay on the right monitor, but the colour was so different. Now if you look just below my portrait, we have Game Capture 2. This is just what I called it, you can call it anything you want obviously, and you probably already have. Um, I have a capture specific window, and when I've got Sekiro, or any game for that matter, live, I will put it into this box. Now the problem with this is, any time I had it on full screen application, I had issues trying to capture um, the game in any way, shape or form. That's maybe another video for another day or something for me to Google, but as it stands right now, capture specific window and I have Sekiro in that box. This is where the downfall is. Because it's specific window, for some reason, this is where it falls down. When I was playing Sekiro, it was in full screen mode. Now, the problem with this was, I believe OBS is thinking that it is in a windowed mode because it's capturing a specific window. So this is footage of me playing Sekiro earlier in the week on full screen mode and you'll see just by looking at it that the colours are really dull, really washed out, there's nothing vibrant about it at all. The reason I used a clip with fire was just to show you the difference between what it was and what it is going to be. You'll see that the colours were ab absolutely washed out, terrible, but now after fl putting Sekiro into windowed mode, it works with OBS that much better. Um, you still can't tell the difference when you're gaming and it completely matches the colour to what I'm actually seeing, to what the streamers will see, and this is the, the circumstance of that clip. Here we go. So I've chose this clip specifically because we're atop of the pagodas on a different stream on Twitch once we'd fixed the colour settings. It just shows how vibrant the sky is and the colours popping a lot more. I know OBS can be infuriating at times. This is a small fix that's worked for me to fix the colours. I have seen some other streamers with the same issues, some people thinking that's just how their stream is meant to be. But rest assured, there's too many settings to go through. I will help as best I can if you want to drop a comment. If this didn't work, um, leave a like, I'd appreciate that. We're on our way to 100 for a YouTube giveaway, 50 for that Twitch giveaway. But uh, any help I can give to any other streamer, content creator, as minimal or as much help as that may be, uh, I'm more than happy to do that. Remember, like I said, Change it to window mode if your game is capturing a specific window and the colours should translate to the content that you, that you are recording or streaming. Thanks so much for watching this video, I really appreciate it, I really hope it helped and fixed your issue. If it did, hey I'd love a like, if it didn't, leave a like and a comment, let me know how you fixed it. It'll teach me, it'll teach others, that's what we're, this is all about, just helping each other, trying to get the best stream possible for your viewers and for yourself. That's the main thing, got to look out for you. I hope to all see you in the future and I hope this helped, thanks, bye. Woo.